This week, Donald Trump released his new tax plan, which was immediately shot down by his political opponents on the left. But what would those same people think if they were told that that tax plan was actually Bernie Sanders' plan? Today, we're at George Washington University in Washington, D.C. to find out. What were your thoughts on Trump's tax plan when you saw it? Um, it's very, it's better for the upper class than anyone else. Pretty much a uh, horrible for the middle class, especially the lower class. I mean, not ideal. It's probably not the most efficient nor beneficial to the general populace. Pretty negative. <laughs> I feel the same. Yeah, yeah. So Bernie Sanders came out with his plan. Some people call it the compassionate alternative. So we're getting opinions on Bernie's plan. First, one of Bernie Sanders' plans is to enhance the child tax credit, which is tax money given back to families when they have children. What do you think of that? Positive or negative? Positive. All right. Same. I was a social worker, mm -hmm. so I understand how important tax credits like that are. Parents that go, have children go through a lot, and I think giving back money to them really, in turn, helps the children. I think that's great. I think that's positive, definitely. Okay. Positive, definitely. Next up, uh, eliminating the death tax. So when people die, it's a large tax on their estate that goes to their family. What do you think of that? I think that's definitely something that we should be doing. I do think that's a good idea because I'm from New Jersey and we used to have like a really heavy inheritance tax. I'm in favor of that. I would say po more positive. I think I agree with that. Bernie is planning to lower the small business tax rate to a maximum of 25%. I think that's a positive or negative? Um, I definitely think that's a positive. I feel very positively toward that. My family has a small business, so I would definitely think that's a positive thing. Taxing them less makes more sense. Any way we can help small businesses work and like thrive, it's definitely something that's beneficial for the country. I think that would be great. Overall, main idea of the plan, what do you think? Bernie did a good job, bad job? I think overall, good. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, good job. All good right. job, Bernie. I think it's a definitely a good plan, a positive plan that can help everyone. I think it's pretty good, like uh, definitely better than Whatever Trump is proposing, I would make that leap right there. So, what if I told you this actually is Donald Trump's tax plan, not Bernie's? You got me. <laughs> it is. It's, it's Trump's plan. Hello, darkness, my old friend. All of these are actually Trump's ideas. So it's actually Trump's plan. What? Wow. <laughs> wow. That's interesting. That, wow. I am shocked that I do agree with Trump on certain things. Okay. Interesting. I'm definitely happily surprised that it like, sounds a lot better than I would have expected it to. I would have imagined he would be a little more stupid than that. Okay, so, but it's not a stupid plan? No, I don't think so. But I think if you said it was Trump, at least for many people it would be more opposition to it just because it was Trump. Like, it could be a policy of giving me ice cream, but if it's Trump, I'd be like, what's in that ice cream? Um, I definitely think there's an initial bias. I mean, I've done it myself. Like, I'll just like, hear the word Trump and I'll be like, ugh. Um, I definitely think that's something to like need to be like looked over. People once they hear Trump or like Republican, they become like, oh, they suck no matter what. I think people definitely hear the name and start to think things automatically. And also because a lot of people just go to the same news sources, the same media, it makes it tough to get other points of views. Yeah.